My hair is just not doing what I want it to do. Oh! <sighs> hey guys. Ow, Jesus. You know what I absolutely love about being an adult? It's not the gray hair. It's not the crow's feet. Uh, surprisingly, it is not the seemingly everly shrinking bladder, but um, being able to do whatever the f I want, I guess. My neighbors are staring at me. Ah, uh, it is. What time is it? It is 9.20 in the morning and I got myself a grilled cheese for breakfast because nobody's gonna tell me what I can and can't have for breakfast. That is <clears throat> a great part of being an adult. You can eat raw cookie dough and grilled cheese for breakfast. I don't have any raw cookie dough here though. I wish I did. The neighbors are really staring at me, huh? I also got, pretend I don't have a straw. I love turtles. We have two turtles. Um, but also, yeah, I shouldn't have got a straw. I'm sorry. Please don't tear me apart. Or do, because I deserve it. I, I don't know if it's only when I wear white. It seemingly is, or maybe it's just when I wear anything, but I get stains on everything. I have like a purple stain over here. I have like, first off when I bought this sweatshirt, I didn't notice it, but there's like a little dark stain over here. Can I get my money back, please? But I swear it's only when I wear white shirts. I got this Obey shirt, this t-shirt, right? It was a white t-shirt, it was super cute. It had like a little flower on the front and then a like, big ass flower on the back. I was in New Orleans, I think, and I had a lush perfume. Now, I'm not coming for anybody. This was my own mistake. I put, it was a lush perfume, but it was one of the ones in like an eyedropper. I don't think they make them like that anymore, but came in like a little eyedropper bottle. So you put little drops on your wrists, like your Audrey Hepburn back in the day, rub that shit together. And I went like this and it stained my white shirt. First day I wore it, I swear to God, I was so upset. I still have that shirt. I haven't worn it. I couldn't get the stain out. If anybody knows how to get it out, please let me know. People staring at me. I think it's because I'm out front of an open house. If you guys want to be my neighbor, my neighbor's house is for sale. Oh no, he has a ma- oh. <laughs> I think my point has been made. <laughs> There's a lid on this. How did, you know what? It was the turtles. The turtles are, are mad at me, so. Please don't break in to my house and try to kill me. Last year, I had a, um, someone tried to break into my house. Why do things like this happen to me? I'm a good f***ing person. Oh, Lord Jesus. You know what? I'm gonna go down here. Everybody thinks I'm on crack. Yes. The rumors are true. Shut the f*** up. I know I'm not wearing my seatbelt. Oh. Like and subscribe. Okay, so I'm an adult who should probably wear a bib. I've seen plenty of adults wear bibs.
granted, that was at a Joe's Crab Shack. <laughs> Either later that night, it might have been a different week, I don't know, but I ended up at Sarah's house, we made some sushi rolls, and then we headed out to Penn's Landing. I cut it wrong. You <laughs> had one jump! <laughs> He laughed. The audacity. Oh, that's I caught you. Sarah, make a wish. What do you wish for? Wish, wish, bitch. Oh, another one in the basket. <laughs> Knock it off, it's a beautiful moment. <laughs> ma'am, <laughs> please do not deface, do fame, ma'am. <laughs> wow. Are we gonna get on? It's almost as pretty as you. I don't know where this place is. Okay. Who did it? Like, is this your pee pee stain? That's your That's your blood. And then we tried to get on the Ferris wheel and the Ferris wheel dude was like, no, you can't get on. And we were like, why not? And he was basically like, it's one o'clock in the morning. And we were like, oh, okay. And then we went to go get some insomnia cookies. And honestly, it was a fantastic end to a fantastic day. Fast forward to the following weekend question mark possibly I, does it matter it was a Sunday and it was a day that I was uh, supposed to help Sarah move from her old apartment to her now new apartment mommy's little crack baby so um, some of you might know this, some of you may not know this. <clears throat> My family's dog, Chance, unfortunately, we had to put him down um, in April. And my mom was having a really hard time parting with his stuff, like something as seemingly simple as um, like food and water dish. Do you hear people doing their like, I'm trying to have a f***ing moment. It is so... It's not even 8 o'clock in the morning on a Saturday. Why are people... Like, this shit... It sounds petty, but, like... I know I'm awake, but other people are trying to f***ing sleep on a f***ing Saturday. Oh my god. Okay, so we moved to the kitchen where you can see... See this on my wall? That's from Band-Aids because I put Halloween decorations up. And I didn't have tape, so I used Band-Aids. So, get crafty. Like I was saying, <clears throat> my mom was having a really hard time letting go of like his food dish and stuff. So she came up with the idea that we make like a little terrarium with it. So we have a little like succulent garden deal. And I thought it was a nice little idea. And then we have it in his food bowl. So it's like a little piece of the doggo. Um, and I love it, and my brother has the other one, and I know my mom likes knowing that we have them here. And the people are still doing the fucking lawn. Can you hear it? Here's the thing. The Nobody has much grass in this, in like, in this entire block. There's not much grass. So I don't know what the fuck they're doing out there. Here's another thing. We live in old houses here, which means, a lot of us don't have central air, which means a lot of us have window units, which means that you can hear everything that's going on outside. Not even eight o'clock in the morning and people are mowing their lawns and weed whacking and leaf blowing. If my skin looks oily, it's actually just supple. Yeah, I used one of those snail secretion things well Hillary kind of just pumped it onto my hand and was like use it and then she was like yeah it's um snail cummies so that's always fun um what was I saying oh yeah F the people who do their law like what is what is you doing why why is you doing it 
I have this camera propped up on a batch of cookies I made last night because I'm sad and not trying to kill myself. <sighs> I just finished saying it's not even like 8 o'clock in the morning, so disgusting. You know I'm going to finish that cookie the second <laughs> this camera is turned off. So I think I'm going to go to the produce store. I need to be at Sarah's soon. I'm helping Sarah move today. Why am I sitting here in my kitchen talking about my dead dog and cookies? That's the question of the day. That's a question I didn't want to ask myself on a Saturday. Okay, bye. Oh, the lighting lords are not with us today. Do you hear how creaky this is? What the? My car is falling apart. I just blew out my speakers listening to Ashley O. You bet your loose pussy lips I did. Um, here I am. Uh, why am I even, I should be in there buying, um, vegetables because health, health, health starts when you start. I don't know. Ah, oh, yes. Back at home, I got my ice black coffee with my reusable straw. Oh, I haven't had coffee in so long because I don't have a coffee pot because I smashed it into a million pieces 2019 is a great time to be alive so if you guys ever wanted to peel back the reusable fibers of my grocery bag um just to you know get a little insight into like John like we know you we know everything about you but what what do you get at the produce store <laughs> well you're in luck because I'm gonna tell you first things first bananas I also got a half a pint of blueberries. This is a super food. This is the food they don't want you to know about. Do some research. Another phallic vegetable from Mother Nature. <laughs> Asparagus, the only food I do not like, but I eat it anyway because it's good for you and I like the way it makes my pee smell. What else we got in here? I got two lemons. They said 99 cents for these. Two? I said yes, please. Okay, I also got a tomato. I got some peaches. We know your girl loves a good peach emoji. I got limes. Keep limes on deck. Keep lemons and limes on deck all summer, ladies. Let me hear it. Um, portobello mushrooms. I fucking love mushrooms. And you wanna know why? Cause I'm a fun guy. I saw an opportunity and I took it. Avocado, a cantaloupe. Um, I heard a lot of people don't like cantaloupe. There's a honeydew. Cause my brother's like, if he won't eat a fruit salad or something if there was honeydew in it. Cause he said it ruins the taste of everything. That's how I am with olives. Keep your olives out my fucking antipasta dishes, bitch. Also, what exactly is antipasta? It, can I eat like antipasta and then like have a bowl of pasta and they like cancel each other out? How does that work? And I also got grapes. Maybe I'll use that as a thumbnail. Thought I looked cute. Probably will delete later. And then I also got, um, I didn't get that from the produce. Oh, that's not produce. Get out of here. I need to clean out my car. I'm literally there, seven minutes ago, movers got to Sarah's house. So if you're watching this, Sarah, and you're wondering why I was late, I am so sorry. I'm gonna go, I'm, I'm on my way, I promise. Uh, but I got you a Gatorade, so don't be mad at me. So obviously I didn't vlog much because I was helping move and it was a lot and I was driving a lot. And like, I know the content is worth it, but I love my friends and I'm not trying to die in a car accident with them. But I would like to die peacefully in my sleep or in a vat of hot fudge. Maybe not. Okay. No, that would be awful. No, I don't want that. Let's not manifest that into the universe. I guess what I'm trying to say is subscribe if you're not subscribed and like this video if you like this video. If you don't like this video, then dislike this video. I don't care. But apparently people have been telling me they are subscribed to me but aren't getting notifications that I'm posting. So if you want notifications, I'm not going to insult you by telling you what to do. But if you want notifications, hit the bell you know where to go for it. And until next time, my manager told me I should have an outro. Um,
I'll work on it. 